People in Chengdu live a life of ease. No matter you ride a bike in a park or enjoy the works by ancient Chinese poets, it's quite comfortable here. For the middle-aged people and the old, Chengdu is the best place to enjoy themselves. Finding a tea house or developing their habits can be the best choices for them. However, except the enjoyment, the diligent people here are making contributions to the city to make it better. People in Chengdu live a rich cultural life. Affected by Du Fu, a great poet, calligraphy becomes a popular art here. Except the beauty of the ink and paper, shadow poetry is a colorful classical art. Lying in the southwest of China, the architecture in Chengdu is of antique beauty and delicate, from a park to a university. Furthermore, the lantern show in Temple of Martyrs, built in 223 A.D., is also attractive. Whatever the art in Chengdu is, it's a fruit of wisdom. People in Chengdu live a natural life. Because the weather is warm and moist, it's suitable for not only human but also many animals to live. And this is a place where you can see the harmony between the human and nature. Additionally, we have special love for pandas, which are black with white. From morning to dusk, Chengdu is always a friendly city, welcoming people from different places. She is energetic, enthusiastic, and all-inclusive. She likes vigorous contemporary art, but she still remembers the classical traditional art. She enjoys anime and creative decoration at the Bandun factories, but she is also fascinated by the mystery of religions. She is Chengdu, where the new life starts.